never know what you would do until you're in that situation where you're at your wit's end. Tonight, neighbors are shaken after a violent attack between a mother and son turns into a deadly police involved shooting in Henderson. Thanks for joining us. I'm Trisha Keen. This happened at an apartment complex near Eastern and Horizon Ridge Parkway. 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels spoke to the people there who are trying to make sense of what happened. Police are calling this a very tragic situation. We spoke to neighbors who say they didn't really see anything from the outside that would have led them to believe what happened from the outside looking in neighbors at this Henderson apartment complex can only imagine what went on behind closed doors because I feel as a community we have to do better. Um, the fact that I knew who this woman was, but I was not personally attached to her makes me somewhat like I'm responsible. Judy Warner, a mother of three kids, says she knows of the mom who police now say was behind a violent attack on her seven year old son, stabbing him multiple times. As a mom, I have to step up. I have to do better. Like, it's my wake up call, you know? And it's not like to move out of here. It's just to, like, if I notice something, I hear something, I see something, I need to get more involved. It was around noontime when Henderson police got a 911 hang up. When they called back, they quickly figured out there was a violent fight going on inside the apartment. Moments later, police say they found the mom agitated and one officer shot her. She was taken to a hospital where she died. The boy rushed into emergency surgery and is expected to survive. Obviously, this is a, a tragedy for anybody involved in a situation like this, so we want to use due care and take care of everyone as best we can. As investigators try to get to the bottom of what happened, stunned neighbors like Warner are now asking themselves, could they have stepped in or noticed any warning signs? But you never know what you would do until you're in that situation where you're at your wit's end. And I'm not condoning what she did, but you never know until you hit rock bottom where you're like, oh my gosh. And for whatever reason, she felt this is what she needs to do. And I don't agree with it, but people should have stepped in. People should have helped her out. Police were unable to reveal if they had any previous calls for service at the apartment. No officers were hurt. The name and age of the mom shot by police will be released later. The officers involved in the shooting will be placed on routine leave pending the investigation. Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.